They're in the gate. And they're off to a smooth start in Speedboat Beach and Hijazi, both with sharp early speed. Sharp as attack splits that pair and moves to be a joint second. They're followed by Giant Mischief in the orange colors, racing along the inside. Fort Bragg is tugging his way, very eager in the early stages, but nowhere to go. He's right inside Damon's Mound, and Ray's Kane is just four lengths off Hajazi, who's a little quicker than Speed Boat Beach and leads by a head to the half-mile pole. Sharp is attacked two off the pace in third, and Damon's Mound inches up outside of him. Giant Mischief aggressively pushed along down at the rail. Then it's Fort Bragg, four lengths off his stablemates, rounding the far turn. As Speedboat Beach takes the lead, Ray's Kane trails. It's Speedboat Beach. Hijazi comes right back, and those two race to the quarter pole together. Hijazi cruising along, has his head back in front of Speedboat Beach. Damon's Mound is in third. Down at the rail, Giant Mischief there at the top of the stretch. Hijazi and Speedboat Beach. Speedboat Beach. Beach has another gear and opens up a length on Hijazi at the eighth pole. Four more to Giant Mischief and Damon's Mound. It's Speed Boat Beach and Flavian Pratt. Hijazi trying hard, but Speed Boat Beach has won the Malibu decisively by two lengths over Hijazi. Giant Mischief was third, then Damon's Mound and a photo between Fort Bragg and Ray's Kane. Speed Boat Beach sizzles home in 121.70 seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, here's Speedboat Beach. Speedboat Beach is a three-year-old dark bay or brown coat by Byron out of Sophia Mia, owned by Mike Pegram, Carl Watson, and Paul Whiteman. The winning trainer, Hall of Famer Bob Baffert. Bob Baffert sends out the winner and the runner-up. And the jockey, Flavien Pratt. That's a riding triple. Congratulations. Three wins and a phenomenal ride in the Malibu from Flavian Pratt. Speedboat Beach was bred in Florida by Caper Lane Farm. The running time, a crisp 121.70 seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time we direct your attention to the winner's circle as Santa Anita Park is so honored to welcome a true superstar, a man considered by many to be the greatest jockey of all time, Lafitte Pink Eye Jr., as he presents the Malibu Stakes Trophy. A 14-time winter meet leading rider and a six-time Malibu winner, Lafitte Pink Eye Jr. retired as Santa Anita's all-time leading jockey with 2,860 winter meet victories. A six-time Eclipse Award winner. At the time of his retirement in 2003, Lafitte was the world's winningest jockey with 9,530 career wins. Please join us in welcoming El Pirata, the great one and only Lafitte Pink Eye Jr., Millie Ball in the winner's circle. Thank you very much, Frank. Taking the grade one Malibu, trainer Bob Baffert with Speed Boat Beach. And it looked like a, a heck of a horse race with the two of your horses coming down the stretch there. You knew he was a good horse when he ran second off of nine months in the Santa Anita Sprint. Talk about how he's matured since then, Bob. Well, I mean, his, his, his issues have always been he's very aggressive. He's aggressive in the mornings. He was aggressive in his race. And um, we've been slowing, you know, getting him relaxed. A lot of school, and I got a great team. They've been working a lot, you know, all my riders and my assistants. And so, uh, and Pratt worked him for me the other day, and he actually worked really well with Pratt. He got along with him really well, got him to come off the bit a little bit. Uh, I was worried about my other horses in there. They're going to be in there with him. And, and so uh, it was a good feeling turning for home. I knew I was going to win it. I wasn't sure which one it was going to be, but uh, I would like to run one, two, three. But uh, Speedboat Beach, he's always shown since his first out he was something special, and hopefully he can build from this. And absolutely no disgrace with the second-place finish of Hijazi. 
Yeah, see, I think he's going to be a, he's a serious horse, and uh, he was a little bit keen today. We weren't able to train this last week, so he was telling me that he didn't, he couldn't get him to relax very well, so he used himself up a little bit, but um, I, I see big things from him down the road. Well, congratulations to you and, of course, your connections. Pegram Watson and Whiteman taking down the grade one Malibu Stakes with Speedboat Beach.